Hi, welcome to another episode of Hot Takes. Kemi Badenoch says that reform voters should come home to the Conservatives. She says that they are natural Tories. She describes them as our sort of people. And she's probably right, but I think she's going the wrong way round. I think what's happening increasingly is our sort of people, the Tories, are moving across to reform. Because for the Reform Party, Reform UK, Tories are our sort of people. And Tory voters are seeing that increasingly. And once we get the uh, Conservative Party conference out of the way this weekend, I think the Tory party will be in for a bit of a shock because it's when four become two. Uh, they're going to have their um, their beauty pageant. They're going to line them all up, these people. They're all going to have interviews and talk and discuss, give a little piece to camera and all this and, you know, put themselves out and, and about, meet and greet, shake the meat. And then the Tory MPs will then decide which of those four will go forward to be the two offered up for ritualistic slaughter to the members. If Kemi Badnock isn't one of them, then I think many, many people at that Tory conference or people who are at the conference but are still Tory members may not be Tory members for very much longer and will become reform members. And it won't take many before there's more reform members than Tory members if it hasn't happened already. And this will be worrying uh, Tory HQ. But Kemi has recognised this. And I think her... Uh, her statement that uh, reform voters are our people, as she's putting it, could be, I think, um, a hidden, a hidden warning. I think she's sending up a smoke signal there. I think she's saying to the Tory MPs, if I'm not on that ballot, I'm going to reform and I'm taking our people with me. And I think many would go. I think if Kemi went, many would go. I think if Kemi went, Pretty Patel may well go. There'll be a few others that may go. You might end up with, who knows, half a dozen Tory MPs becoming reform MPs. And that, of course, would change everything. Forever. Especially going into next year's council elections. Because let's face it, the Tories are pretty toxic at the moment. Labour have shot themselves in both feet. And it's just not viable for anyone else to be voted for except reform. Other smaller parties are available, but let's face it, in reality, not. The Lib Dems may well do a little bit better. And ironically, and I covered this in a video yesterday, the SNP may even pick up a few weirdly... Not that they're good, they're just less bad than Labour. But it's a very, very strange time. But I think that Kemi is giving advance notice to the um, the upper echelons, the high, you know, the uh, the high table, as it were, of the um, Tory party, that she has to be on the ballot or else. But we shall find out. Tory party conference coming soon. Kemi may be going soon. Let's wait and see. Thanks a lot. Bye.